All right, another day at the park. It's uh, really windy, cold, probably about 32 degrees. April 23rd, Upper Peninsula, Michigan. Um, using the eight, uh, Equinox 800 and um, had a really crappy signal. Almost didn't dig it, but I got something here. So let's see what it is. It's in this little clump, probably a weedy. But let's just take a look. Alright. Uh, actually, you know what? This might be... Looks to me like it might be a, an Indian coin. Yep. Cool. An Indian. Let's see if I can get a date on this thing. A lot of these coins around here are... Pretty much to oh yeah this one might have a date nineteen oh one maybe I don't know could be a nineteen oh one kinda hard to tell on that anyways there it is pretty cool alright I was out here earlier this morning out here at the park and uh, man, I I got a uh, Indian head penny. I think it's 1900. And then I ended up getting a, a 1911 V nickel. Uh, then after that, well, I went to go uh, record that, and my phone died. I mean, so I I couldn't get the live dig on that. And then I also got a 1917 Mercury dime. Um, like I said, my phone was dead, so I couldn't record any of it. So anyways, went back home, charged my phone, and, uh, I'm back out here. I don't have a, I don't have a, uh, what do you call that, um, GoPro or anything. So I just use my phone. Anyways, um, I'm back out here, and with a fully charged phone, hopefully it doesn't die on me. And I just got this, haven't dug it out of the... I haven't dug this out of the pit yet. But anyways, uh, it was giving me 11, 12 signal, mainly solid 11 on the Equinox 800. So let's see what it is. It appears to be a nickel. Hopefully it's not a modern one. Um, this soil is not the greatest. Oh, you know what? It's, it's going to be another V nickel, looks like. It's really, uh, this soil really has tarnished these coins. And I'm, I'm kind of nervous to rub on them too much because I don't want to, I don't want to ruin them. But let me see if I can get a date off of this one real quick. And, uh, let's see, it's going to be a 19... It looks like 1913 maybe 1918 oh man I don't want to rub on this thing too much all right we'll just say it's a 1913 or something but it's uh it's gonna be a V nickel and see if I can't get the yeah there's gonna be the the V on this thing let me give this a rub on my pants real quick. There's the V coming through. Right there. Let me just rub this on my pants real quick and see what happens. If that cleans it up at all. And uh, sorry about the wind. Super windy. Oh crap, that made it worse actually. Or maybe it made it better, I don't know. There's the V. Uh, if you can see the date, it's 19-something. I'll rub on my pants. I don't know. It might ruin it. Let's just see. That makes it better or worse. That's uh, about the same. I'm going to say... It's a 19... 19 maybe, 1918, 19... Something like that. 1918 maybe. I don't know. Anyways, it's a V nickel. It's the second one I got today. I'll show the pictures of the other ones I got, but 
Like I said, unfortunately, I couldn't get a live dig on it. But All right, well, back in the pit. Somebody else can find it. All right, here's another coin I got. Let's see. It's right here in this chunk out of this hole here. Uh, just found that um, V-nickel. So let's see what this thing is. Actually, I think it's a, uh, well, I'm pretty sure it's like a penny of some sort, either a weedy or, um, not exactly sure. Oh, it's going to be a weedy. I can see Lincoln's head. There's Lincoln's head. What's left of it. But, yeah, it's going to be pretty much gone. Well, back in the pit it goes. Somebody else can find it. Thanks for watching.